In today's video, I am going to deconstruct my this shot. How I executed, why I merged two shots, behind the scenes, and editing. Let's dive in. Here is my basic setup. Uh, actually, I used a free website to create this lighting diagram in which you can see the simple minimal gears. I used two cheap lights and uh, my background is a four feet octa. The key light is a strip box, one feet by four feet strip box. Let's check the BTS. This is my Vanguard tripod. You can find all the affiliate links in the video description if you want to support my channel by buying affiliate links on the Amazon. And uh, here is my 60 Mark II with uh, Tokina 100mm 1 is to 1 lens. It's micro lens. I have done so many beauty shots with this lens and uh, micro shots. And definitely I'll uh, get one video uh, very soon about micro photography which is really my passion which i will really share with you guys very soon the editing part is uh, pending so the setup of the the shoot is very simple so i uh, used a computer table as my tabletop to demonstrate uh, every beginner who can easily shoot without big setup here is my four feet octa on a rock solid uh, heavy tripod then if the octa is really big like four feet it has itself a huge weight then the, the octa i used as my background uh, i will sh share with you very soon in, in the editing part how it worked then my key light which is a strip box one feet by four feet without any grid or this is my subject i got this uh, brandy bottle from my friend i borrowed this to shoot uh, and the platform is a white acrylic sheet which i got uh, by three by four feet so let's uh, dive into the editing part i will show you how i edited and uh, executed the shot this is the four, five in one, four in one, I guess, four in one or five in one reflector I used uh, in front of my strip box to soften my key light. I will, I would like to share my the, uh, my whole journey how I started. And uh, in the first setup, I did some lighting test as you can see uh, the beginning shots were in jpg because i was shooting a wedding um, before uh, that so i forget to change the setting usually i shoot raw in the studio uh, as you know so i tried different exposure and then uh, then i moved my camera forward and now this is tight shot actually the issue i was was uh, having uh, during the shoot i can't see the edges of this bottle when i was shooting with the, the octa on the background as a background then i decided to shoot on umbrella to get that edges again and uh, this was the shot actually where uh, there was a umbrella and when i shot with the umbrella as a background i could uh, as you can see umbrella was almost uh, visible so then i added shoot through reflector which is a uh, for which i used as to diffuse the light and to get the edgy sharp then uh, i took two three shots then uh, back to octa exposure was more accurate so as you can see this highlight was there so again i used my same four feet shoot through ref reflector to diffuse the reflection now it's almost gone so this is my final shot like i took it as so here is the final shot this was the raw file so i did little bit of tweaking in the camera row then in the second layer here you can see <coughs> i 
the difference as you can see there is no edge in the first shot which is uh, I took at, uh, as uh, my final shot but then I put it second shot actually I took that shot to show the edges which is on the top of the main shot then I did masking to add the edges to combine by combining these two images this is my final shot so it has edges clear no spilling on the bottle which uh, actually eat up the edges of the bottle and uh, in this uh, layer I did a little bit of uh, spot healing I used uh, a spot healing brush and uh, removed uh, one white white spot there and uh, did a little bit of retouching here and there then I used a curved adjustment layer this is my uh, achieved shot and uh, now I feel like I can go like opacity of the curve layer about 70% uh, where you can see the label and the top of the bottle clearly more visible and prompting here is my final you can check this uh, shot on my instagram and uh, you can follow support me subscribe hit the subscribe button so i like it and if you like it give the thumbs up to the video then and follow me on instagram twitter and uh, don't forget to subscribe very soon i am going to share a video on micro photography and the, in, in the same video i am going to review my tokina 100mm 1 is to 1 lens which is very beautiful lens micro photography there is uh, there is very important i have one telegram channel where we can discuss lot much on these topics in a community form where we can discuss very frequently on this these topics Link of the telegram channel is in the video description and uh, flashing on the screen. Please consider to uh, join that channel. And in the last, thank you so much for watching. I edit and uh, and about its editing and uh, about its editing I edited this shot let's dive into actually I used uh, a strip box the it's uh, this uh, in the uh, <coughs> two uh, like lights I used two seams and uh, as you can see, uh, yes, you can find, you can, you can find all the affiliate links, all the affiliate links for my gears. My